Isla Frederick Fitness TV. Good morning, guys. So right now it's about 7 a.m. in the morning, and uh, I'm just waking up here. It's a lovely Saturday. Um, I'm on my computer just sending some updates to my clients, uh, sending out some emails to my online portion of things. Um, kind of do this every morning. I uh, spend about half an hour to an hour sending out emails in the morning and then I'll get up, make my breakfast um, and then I'll hit the gym um, or at least go for some light cardio and, and do some abs and then do my you know heavier training portion resistance training tonight. Um, but yeah, anyways, love you guys over and over. So, so many people, I've been getting a lot of inquiries about this uh, product that I bought. So I'm just going to kind of show you guys again. Um, so I have this for my breakfast. It's kind of like my breakfast shake. I, I, I don't like to replace my actually whole meal because I still feel like the body needs something to digest and you still need to get that meal in you. But I was like a pre- snack before my breakfast i'll have this so it's it's optimum nutrition it's energy protein so it's almost like and this flavor here is uh vanilla it has a little bit of a hint of like that cappuccino flavor and what it is is it's essentially drinking a cup of coffee and a protein shake kind of at the same time so it's it's just like protein coffee it's actually really good something that i like to take in the morning um, so yeah, I'm just gonna, it's morning time, so I'm gonna just quickly make my, uh, shake. Um, you guys can buy this online at bodybuilding.com. Um, I bought this at Extreme Line Supplements in, uh, in Cherry Park. So, uh, everybody kind of asks me, like, what do you kind of eat throughout the day? What are your, uh, like, what do you take for lunch? What, like, what, how do you meal prep and stuff like this? So, I got my trusty six pack bag it's pretty much my best friend so i i take it everywhere i go um so let me just show you guys what's what's all in here so this is a cooler pack essentially um so i got i bought these from costco just it's like a protein shake already made 30 grams of protein um and then i got my 16 egg whites i usually chug that just after lunch um usually around one o'clock two o'clock is when i'll do that See what's inside. So I got my protein chips, just kind of something to snack on throughout the day. <clears throat> um, check this out, delicious, I meal prepped it. So as you can see, there's a chicken breast, and I got extra lean ground bison, got some asparagus, and then as well as just a kind of a rice quinoa blend mix from Costco as well. I buy a lot of my food from Costco. I just, my bison I get somewhere else just because you can't buy them from Costco. Um, got a banana. Banana, I like the high glycemic levels that it gives you for your body. And then I got this. People think it's like a bunch of drugs. Just vitamins. So you got a multivitamin. Um, has your vitamin A's, to B's, to C's, to Z's, X, Y's, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> and then the middle uh, section, that's your glucosamine. So that's good for your joints, just kind of really strengthens the joints and stuff. And then um, omega-3 fish oil pills. That's really all I take for uh, vitamins. I don't really take calcium pills because I get enough calcium in my diet. Um, if you're lactose intolerant and still need to get that or adequate calcium intake, spinach, broccoli, things like that actually have, surprisingly, has calcium in it. Um, so yeah, basically, um, I pack this in my car, take it wherever I go. And uh, no excuses, right? Like you're driving down the road and oh man, I see McDonald's, I'm hungry. And then you're like, oh wait, I've got my six pack bag. Pull your meals out, good to go. Hey guys, just finished a shower here. Just, uh, just brushing my teeth. So a lot of people, what they'll do is they'll wake up, they'll brush their teeth, shower, then they'll eat their breakfast. And they go, and it's like, why? Now you got all that food stuff in your mouth? Eat breakfast, then brush your teeth. Anyways, gonna brush my teeth. Uh, just got out of the shower. Gonna be hitting up the gym, doing my resistance training for tonight. Enjoy, it's leg day.
Hey guys, so uh, just gonna kind of show you what I take before the gym. So it's leg day, so this is a must. Um, so it's the new gold standard pre-workout by Optimum, Optimum Nutrition. Um, so what I do is uh, toss a scoop in here. So you can go one, two, one scoop, two scoops, depending on uh, like the intensity of your training and stuff. Um, because it's leg day, I usually do a little more, but today, because I have somewhat of some good energy, because I had a good breakfast in me, um, I'm just gonna do one scoop of that. This is my secret. So it's the Monster Energy, zero calories. It's the Ultra Zero, zero calories, zero sugar, zero everything. It's their new orange flavor. Really good. Um, gonna pour just about a quarter of it in here. Just to kind of give it like that orange flavor. So the pre-workout is blue raspberry and then this is orange and then I usually add a scoop of creatine. People say you know should you take it before workout, after workout, when should you take it? Um, I've been taking it before my workout and I've seen really good results with it so obviously I'm going to continue taking it before. But for some people they might be a better responder after the workout, after their muscles have been, um, you know, dilated with blood and, ha and has been engaged. That might be the best time for them to actually take their uh, other pre-workout. So, anyways, gonna down this down, gonna hit the gym. So, like I said, it's leg day, and uh, you gotta visualize what you want in your head when you come to the gym. What do you want? Are you just coming to the gym and saying, I'm gonna try this machine, try this machine? Or are you gonna come in and be like, hey, you know what, like, I really wanna get these nice toned legs, nice hamstrings, glutes, really get the separation between the muscles and stuff, and really visualize what you want. And what I'll do is, I'll watch YouTube videos of just like, people with nice legs working out, just, you know, for motivation, so that I kinda know what I want. And then I'll come here, and I'll really just pump it hard. Um, let's try this out. Mm. Scut, scut, scut. I like scut. Scut, scut, scut. If you can name what movie that's from, I'll give you five bucks. It's from a movie. This goes down smooth. Anyways, let's get some. Well, that was a successful leg day. Oh man, I am tired. Man, I feel like uh, they should build more handicap lanes for those that, uh, you know, people that do leg day. I'm sure gonna feel it tomorrow. Man, that was intense. Anyways, I'm gonna go home and have a high carb meal. Um, I like to replenish my glycogen storage right after workout. So I'll have some fruit um, or even better, um, I'll have some BCAs because it does have the, uh, you know, the glycogen levels are pretty high in BCA, so it's good to just restore that. When you work out, um, a lot of people say your most important meal is your breakfast. I disagree. I think it's your pre and post workout meals. Just because you need to give your body what it needs to have a workout and to push through a workout, but then you also need to give your body what it needs to repair and recover after a workout. Anyways, I'm getting some weird looks because uh, I'm actually holding a selfie stick right now, making a video and there's <laughs> there's people pointing, hey, it's my buddy, there's people pointing and uh, laughing at me. But you know, you wanna get swole, you have a goal, you have a dream, you have a vision, it doesn't matter what people think of you, you're gonna push hard. Anyways, enjoy. So I just got back from the gym, so uh, basically I'll be eating one of my meals. So it's chicken, bison, uh, truline, ground bison with uh, quinoa and rice blend. Um, banana. Uh, I'll have this and BCAs as like my uh, sugars for replenishing the glycogen levels. And then as well as another source of carbs, good carbs. I bought this at Extreme Line. 
It's P28 bread. It's basically 28 grams of protein in this bread. Um, they're bagels, um, but they're not as processed as the ones that you'd buy like at Safeway or like in the store. Um, I love this stuff because, like I said, it's very, very high in protein, but you're still getting that complex carbs that you need. So I'll have one of these with a little bit of peanut butter on it, have a banana, and then I'll eat my meal, which this one alone is about 600 calories. So all together I'm consuming almost close to 900, 2000 calories post workout. That's what I do. I like to consume a huge bulk of my calories after workout, especially on a leg day. Um, my leg day is a high carb day. I only have two high carb days a week. The rest is just my regular carb days. And then um, I'm not having a low carb day right now until about another five weeks. And then I'm gonna be leaning out and then start having low carb days. But uh, right now, um, yeah. That's pretty much it, I guess. So gonna eat up, grub up, and then gonna be heading out tonight. Um, got some things planned, so see you guys there.